where this gets hard at is when we have the alternate equation for the circle. And what we want to do really is get it into the brackets because the brackets was nice and easy to read the answers out of. So let's have a look at the x values first and then we can look at the y values. Finally, we can look at the radius. So with the x coordinates to factorize that, it's going to be x minus 6. So essentially, we are completing the square here. And then we're going to have the negative 6 is going to be multiplied out. So with the negative 6 multiplied out, it's going to give 36. So we need to take that away to cancel it out. Then we're going to complete the square for the pink section for y. That's going to be um, y minus 2 all squared. Again, we have the negative 2 squared is 4. That's an extra bit we didn't ask for because we didn't actually take into account a, a plus 4 here. So we have to take away that 4. And then we've got the plus 31. And it's all equal to 0. Now, what we actually want with this is we want the kind of the x bracket section. And we want the y bracket section.